Hello everyone, this is Mason at Tech Beaver, and today I'm going to do a little review of Codecademy. Codecademy is an online website, um, or learning center, whatever you want to call it, where you can learn um, different courses for coding or teach um, different things. So right now if you go to codecademy.com, it'll um, probably ask you to log in, um, and I already am logged in, I can log out and show you. If you come on, this is what you see. Learn to code interactively for free. Um, I'll give you this thing. You can just do three plus four, and I see seven. Um, so you can cheat different stuff there. You can it says build projects, join the community, be recognized. So you can do um, different things like Code Academy Labs for the projects. I'll show you that in a little bit. Um, for join the community, there's they have forums and different things. So you can talk to different coders and things, which is pretty cool, and be recognized. Um, People can see your profile. I'll just log in quickly. I'll sign in. And I have a bunch of accounts. Okay. So, um, also, um, up here, we have this little bell, which is your notification. So, when people, like, comment on if you have any questions about the projects and stuff, this is your streak. So, this brings you to your profile. So, it says 80 points today, 9-day streak. Um, and then you can... Um, edit account settings, review my profile. So you can write a little bit about yourself, put a website, and then add your social media stuff. Um, you can see your total points you've gotten and the best um, full day of points that you've gotten as like a high score or whatever. Um, and then you have your goals. Oh, this is something that I made. Let's see. I'll show you that later. Um, it says HTML and CSS, so that is a class that I'm taking right now. There's JavaScript. I just finished that actually today, um, and then I was doing some Python. So down here you see some code bits that I have made. There's the robbery, my rock, paper, scissors game, um, hour of code, and about you. So this is just test with um, HTML. Um, so I, I will actually go through these. So this is my rock, paper, scissors game. Um, these code bits are different things, so I'll just quickly do this. And there's always a tie. You do it twice. And then when it's done, it loads this. Hello there, I'm guessing you just played my game, which I coded in JavaScript. But first, place to play again. Um, the other thing you can do is you can look at my code to see what I did. Um, that, that The only one annoying thing is it will constantly ask you. So what I do when I was like editing it is I had to put these two slashes to... Um, make it a comment so that it wouldn't actually work because it'll keep just keep asking you anyways I can go back to the main website and so here are the courses HTML, Python, JavaScript um, I'll show you the other things that you can do so it kind of gets annoying at some points um, if I go to learn con codecademy.com says learn you have these things I did my the about you you can do sun earth and code or animate your name um, the other things popular programming languages to learn you have HTML and CSS jQuery JavaScript PHP Python and Ruby um, so those are the six main ones that they have um, courses on and then if you want to practice your knowledge or test your knowledge on um, those different things. You can do web projects, which is HTML and CSS and JavaScript, or APIs, which connects with apps and like YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, cool things like that. Um, so they they are adding some more. So they might have some for like Python or Ruby something in the future, and they might have also other programming languages that they teach in the future. If you also scroll down to the page, you can see the learn to code, the different things that you can learn. Um, also, the other programs, they have Code Academy Schools, which I'm pretty sure is just for um, regular schools. If you like a public school and you want to have your whole school um, do this, then I think there's something about that. Success Stories, what, is have, what has happened to people who have learned this, um, and Code Academy Labs. So you can just go right here, and it'll say Ruby, Python, or JavaScript. So you can go into either of these um, things, and then for some reason... It doesn't, it, it like logs me in, but it doesn't log me in over here for whatever reason. But um, you can do Ruby, Python, or JavaScript. So I could just quickly say, let's quickly do this to show you guys. Hello from, from Mason. 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 
Now say it. So this is where you can test your stuff, and um, you can also take this to pace spin. But I'll do another little review on that later. Um, so that pretty much sums up CodeAcademy.com. Um, it is free, so there's no charge. You can learn pre um, any of these programs for free. There's a bunch of different classes. The forums are awesome. I'll quickly show you that. Let's say, let's say you're doing you're learning HTML. I'll just press the continue button. Um, and this is the actual. Um, interface, I guess. So you have your um, the the topic, so you can go through the different topics that they have or lessons. I look at them as lessons, and then the exercises in the lessons, and then it says course by Lang Li. Um, this is the title of the the lesson or exercise, and then you have what um, this is or what you're going, um, what it wants you to do, and then instructions is actually t is telling you step by step what you need to do. Um, and then you'll have to save and submit and go to the next one and it'll give you errors and all a bunch of stuff. So if you are confused and you have no clue what the heck is wrong with your code, you can either go to the glossary or you can go to question and answer form. So if you click on this button, it'll open a new tab to Code Academy says forums and then to the lesson that you are on. And you can this is the lesson so you can do any of these and then pick exercise. So I was on which one was I on? I was on min lesson breather, so the very first one. I just started this. Um, so then you can sort questions. I usually do it to most active. And then you can just click on this and see if there's any answers or if you can um, help to. You can ask questions. Um, so it's it's really easy and you usually get a response really quickly. Usually um, a day is the most that I've waited. I don't think I've even waited a day. So it's an excellent um, community that they have. Uh, you can do different forms and follow different things. So that will sum up pretty much the review of Code Academy. If you um, think you're interested, go check it out. Um, it is definitely a great learning tool. Um, if you did like this video, please press that like button below this video. Please subscribe to the channel if you would like more. And of course, comment. Um, tell me other reviews or tutorials or whatever um, on different things. I need ideas. So, that's it. This is Mason. See ya!